What was that like to you? Yeah, it was a great experience. Yeah. Uh, it was definitely an awesome experience being able to get a door to jail. Like, <laughs> just an atmosphere there is different. Now, in high school, I mean, you get there at the end. How similar is that mindset in high school to get to the dome to being now where you get to the dome and play for an SEC championship and then eventually maybe a college football Yeah, I mean, I, I have the same mindset. I think you need to have a mindset every day to go out there, get better every day, and want to win. You mentioned uh, when we last spoke that uh, you know Isaiah Wynn felt like to play any position uh, maybe was the most uh, talented. You know, um, Coach Sale sort of echoed that yesterday. What have you seen from him just in these first two weeks of camp? Um, he's just a, he's a great player. Um, he's a very focused player, and uh, I mean, he can help us anywhere really. Let's talk. Let's talk about that snap technique that they were talking about the other day. Yeah. So what? I think was it Sailor? Uh, one of them said that you didn't know how to throw a pass. So. <laughs> yeah. A little shaky at first with, uh, with doing the traditional style, but I've, yeah. I switched over to the uh, old school. You grab the top of the ball, fling it back. I know, like I think like Tennessee and Oregon or someone else does it. So it's kind of a knuckle ball. Well, it's not, it doesn't like, it's not like in their red. Yeah. It comes back pretty solid. Yeah. And it goes back a lot faster than the normal. Yeah. Sale did say yesterday that it was, uh, that everything was fine with it. Yeah. So, cool. No, Coach Rick said that, that he thought you kind of took the YouTube to kind of figure out how to, how to do that. I mean, can you talk to me about your research? Yeah, me and uh, Kurt Sale had talked about it a little bit. And then, uh, I was just really frustrated during camp, so I went went down there, I went on YouTube, and I found some video of this guy. He was in his office, and he's like, I'll show you how to snap a football perfectly every time. And I just saw that, and I popped their sale. And, um, you know anything about this guy who uh, made the video? <laughs> but it worked for you. Yeah, it works. <laughs> so you're thinking of putting up a YouTube video now? That you can... <laughs> if, it, if it's on the internet, it has to be what true. Copyright. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when did this happen? Uh, during camp. We, I spent, probably after the first couple of days, I switched from my uh, traditional to the school style. So now that you know how to uh, snap, how will describe your adjustment to being the new starting center? Uh, definitely just like lets me not like before I was just really yeah. thinking about the snap. Now I can focus on everything else that's going on around me. And we talked to you in the spring, and you mentioned uh, a lot more mental responsibilities in that position. How has that transition and adjustment been for you? Uh, it's definitely been good. I've been uh, just learning a lot and just trying to get everyone in the right position. Everybody. How do you feel about the chemistry of the offensive line right now at this stage of camp? I feel really good. I mean, we've got a great group of guys from the one season threes. So the whole room is, we're all good friends. I think that's something that's big that we've had in Georgia is that when we when we leave here, we're not just going our separate ways. We're all together. And I think that's a good thing.